So right now Becca's V-notching the lobster. And it's a matter of cutting a V-notch in that flipper tail. We hope we're doing it right. I think that's it. It's a second from the right. Just gently cut a piece of the flipper out, which doesn't hurt the lobster. And other people will know that she's a productive breeder. I think you've got a good chunk there. See. It looks like what we've seen before like in other seen ones. Before in other ones. So we'll go ahead and let her go. Why don't you grab her? Oh my gosh, she's so big. This is one of the biggest lot. Why don't you go ahead and measure her just for the sake of it? Just for the sake of seeing the size. She's huge, yeah. So that's like is four, that over the maximum four or no? inches. Is that within the maximum? No, no, it's not. I think that's about four inches. Yeah. That's a biggie. Yeah, it's about the di the same, you know, it's the same distance between the three and a quarter. So it's a little less than four. Probably. Great. So we'll give her a gentle toss back into the ocean. Oh my god. Gosh, she is so heavy. <laughs> now we have new question crabs here. And there's no bait left whatsoever. So did we get one keeper out of that batch? We did. We got one. I forget. I think there were three or four lobsters. Maybe three lobsters? Three lobsters, one... Maybe just two. Just two lobsters and nine crabs. Two lobsters, nine crabs. The keeper and the second one was huge, but it was buried. Excellent. <laughs> okay.